How you guys doing? This is Big Michael Krause, the Redneck Patriot, and uh, we are bringing you the October SHTF Mystery Box. I am so sorry that I have not been getting you guys these videos out fast enough. Uh, I hope you guys got a chance to watch my Christmas stocking video that we did. If you didn't, please go back and look for it uh, and uh, take a gander at it. Please like, comment, and uh, subscribe. Please subscribe. So without further ado, we're going to open up the October. This is the basic box. Uh, and we're going to see what we got inside. And uh, let's see what we got here. No, this did not come in one of the other boxes. This was actually a uh, part of my birthday gift from my wife. Uh, my birthday was on October 4th. So she got me this. I think I was at Walmart or something. So she pulled her. Okay. So like always, you get your paper crap on top. Uh, wait for now. And and we always have to dig for that dang card. Why they put it at the bottom? I don't ever understand. Uh, go ahead and get everything out of here. So, like always, you get cool stuff. Let's see what we would have got here. Dang it, I wish I would have actually done the, uh, the full-size box, because there is some really cool stuff that would have been in this box. But whatever. All right, so let's go ahead and start off with... Um, we'll go with uh, number one. We did the basic box, which is $19.99, and it came in at a retail value of $46.95. So the first thing we get here is a five pack of the Molly Clips. So, or Molly Webbing Clips. So that's pretty cool. So these little clips, I'm not gonna take them out. Uh, you've probably seen them in other videos. Ah, oh, you know what, I will. I will. Since we got something here with Molly on it, we'll go ahead and kind of show you how it works. So these clips here, it's got little fast things on the side. Press them in, take that off like that. Okay. This goes here, through the webbing. Come on, get on there. Don't do me dirty now. There we go. And so that goes there like that. Then you attach whatever it is that you're trying to attach to it. Then you fold this over, push them back in, and then it holds whatever it is that you have, you know, another pouch or whatever, holds it in place for you. Seems to be pretty sturdy too. So that's pretty cool. We'll go ahead and leave that on there. So you get a five pack of these guys, which is pretty awesome. And it comes in at a retail price of four dollars and ninety-nine cents. So a dollar a clip. Um, you know, whatever. It's pretty cool, I guess, for what it is. All right, we'll go down to the next one here. We have the Trailblazer Firestarter Necklace. Now, obviously, actually, this knife is the second item, but we're going to go ahead and skip that and go to this one. This has a retail price of six dollars and ninety-nine cents. See what we got here. Okay, uh, I doubt this is fire cord, but it's an extendable necklace that goes around your neck. So you got your flat surface, and then you actually have your fire still right here. So easy access uh, and really easy to attach something, and you can make it fit, you know, younger kids or full size adults. So, you know, bring that here. So, we can even put it on our little guys. So, he's got his own little fire cord necklace and ready to go. Pretty cool, right? right. Thank you, Braylon. You want to do the next item? Yeah. All right. So, the next item in the uh, box that we're going to do is the uh, five LED angle-headed flashlight. It should be this box right here. I'm gonna go ahead and open that up. Come here, bud. Turn around. Comes in at a retail price of $9.99. 
Um, I'm gonna say that for the necklace, seven bucks, it might be worth it, but I'm not 100%. Uh, it looks like there's no batteries included. Don't know batteries included. I think this takes C batteries, but I'm not 100%. Oops. Wanna grab that for me, buddy? Yeah, sure. Thank you. Sorry about that. Uh, okay, it doesn't actually tell me on here, but I believe it's a C battery. Uh, the cool part is, uh, this is supposed to be styled for the old GI style lights, which is pretty awesome. So, you know, a lot of fun. But if you open up this, it should have, and it does, five color changing discs, or sorry, four changing color discs. A clear, a red, a green, a yellow, and a, a blue, I think, or something like that. Anyways, so those discs actually go up here in the front. Obviously, this would work better if I had the bat had a battery for it to go into it, but it goes actually up here in the front. You remove this, right there. Place the lens in place. Shred it back on, and it makes it so you can turn on your red so you don't lose your night vision. As well as, if I remember correctly, if you put the uh, green and the yellow in there, and, and the red, if I remember right, it actually makes it so you can see blood trails pretty, pretty decently, too. So it's pretty cool, right? You like it? Yeah. All right, I like it, too. Okay. Okay, and then, uh, like I said, that came in a retail price of $9.99. All right, next on the thing we got here is... The M4, or no, sorry, this is the SHTF uh, folding wallet. Pretty cool. Alright, so we have a very simple looking wallet here. Alright, yeah, it's just a very basic, simple <coughs> folding wallet. Nothing super special about it. It's got a spot for you to put your cards here and over here, and then put your cash up here in the middle. Feels like there's some kind of a piece of cardboard or plastic on the inside that kind of keeps it stiff. But overall, pretty cool for what it is. Um, comes in at a retail price of $4.99. Would I go out of my way to buy this? No. No, I would not. It's not worth five bucks in my mind, but for what it is, it's okay. So, uh, and then the last item, which was nineteen dollars and ninety-nine cents, the Jungle Survival two-piece, two-piece knife set. Sweet. So we get two blades in this one. like we have some nylon cordage, definitely not paracord, a uh, simple pocket knife, uh, looks like it's a cyst opening, and it is, pretty sturdy, a little sharp, <laughs> pretty nice finish work to it, um, overall, you know, you can probably get about another five, six feet of cord here, so, nice little knife for what it is, it's not bad, and then the other knife, a little bigger, a little bolder. Okay, now this one I actually do like a little bit. Uh, this is has a rubber molded handle as well as guard. And it looks like it's full tang. It actually does have a crushing pommel here. Um, has some crazy looking saw areas. So, let's see if we can zip, come in on that one, Libby. And as you see there, it actually has some pretty good serrations up there and right here, as well as its half serration with flat blade there. Uh, I, I, I believe this is called a hollow grind, but I might be wrong about that. I'm not 100% sure on that one. But that's pretty cool. Uh, 20 bucks. It feels, feels decent. So I'm not mad at that. Um, is there anything I'm missing on this knife? <coughs> No, it don't look like I am. Uh, see the on the picture here, it shows that there's a fire starter somewhere, but I don't see the fire starter. 
Well, if there's a fire starter, I will definitely have to add that one to the video to show you guys the fire starter. But I don't see it on the blade here. I don't see it on here either. So, I'm going to say no, there's not a fire starter. It's just on the, the pitcher. So, pretty cool though. I am definitely not mad at this box for what it is. I really like the knife. The knife is definitely the the eye caption of this one for sure. So uh, if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, let me know. Please like and subscribe. Uh, if you have any ideas for videos, let me know. This is Michael Giles, the Redneck Patriot, saying thank you for watching. God bless you. God bless America. And have a great day.